Hi, this is Melissa Garza with another episode of Be Inspired. Welcome back for another episode. Um, I just wanted to let you know, oh my goodness, I have just been running around like crazy with my new job and it's been a lot of work and it's really, really rewarding as well. So what I'm going to do right now is um, try to get more rest in because I actually fell asleep before doing this video and trust me I'm not sure if I should just break this video down now into two videos a week um, because of my how large my time commitment is or how to break it down like it's on my mind now of what I should do right now um, I'm not sure as to um, you know move forward or um, step back and change some of my time that I'm committing to doing this even though it's very brief I'm like running around so much it's a uh, the time is, uh, it's been a little bit harder for me to find to sit down here and, and get all dolled up or just get ready and get in front of you and make it happen. So uh, that's something that I'm very, very aware of and I want to make sure that I am doing it right. So um, what I am, you know, it's kind of funny. I've been wanting to help out with the Soul Sisters retreat and yesterday I got a call um, to check my email to know about, you know, if I'm going to be able to serve on the retreat and or if I'm not going to be able to do the commitments. And right now I've been so swamped with work um, and it's just like the, you know, second day basically. And I feel like I don't know if I'm going to be able to serve for the Soul Sisters retreat um, on top of you know everything else I feel like I need actually break and probably to just sit back and enjoy this retreat rather than um, serving and being a little bit more um, you know on worried about on the go and what to do so uh, although I did want to serve I just feel like right now with my time being so frazzled and I'm not sure what's gonna happen in this next week or two weeks that I just really need to be um, very cognizant of um, my time and and how I'm going to go forward. So that's one of the biggest things. I feel like another part of uh, my life as well happened today and well a lot of parts do but um, I've definitely been still talking to this one gentleman and you know think more things are revealed to me every time and just kind of why how, how I'm revealing this or what's coming up to me and and I feel like um, even though I like this person, I'm seeing some circumstances and some repeated behavior and still, and, um, you know, there's part of me that actually does like this person and would really like to see things, um, see this person again and see where things happen, but there might be another party involved right now, and I don't really want to get involved in that with somebody, um, it's just not where I want to take it. If they already have feelings for somebody, I'd like them to just keep on um, going with that so it's making me think as well like you know I know what I want definitely um, but I feel like ah, what is it with so much disappointment in love and so much whatever it's kind of like ah, I don't know if I really even care anymore um, but maybe deep down I think I do so I need to kind of listen to my gut a little bit and, and what it's telling me and kind of to maybe just take a step back um, from things you know because it's, you know, making things happen and making things work sometimes are just not the right thing to do. And that, that's forcing something to happen that's not meant to happen at the right time. So I know that the right time for things will happen. I just need to just, you know, be patient that something else far beyond better is on its way. And know and rest in that state of knowing that. Um... You know, no matter what the situation is or what the outcome, um, I really need to be aware of that. So I don't know if that makes any sense to anybody besides myself, but, um, you know, I feel like there's, you know, there's definitely um, hmm, some attachments of my heart, I will admit. Um, but like I said, I, you know, if you've just been hurt so much, I don't think there's any point to get hurt anymore, but I feel like I would you know, really appreciate friendship from somebody and um, their um, true interest. And if that's not there, I need to like mosey on and 
think about other things because I got way too much on my plate right now <laughs> way too much right now and learning all this stuff and, and getting it all in my brain is oh my goodness it's huge but anyways uh, and I'm taking it on the challenges <sighs> gung-ho so anyways um thank you so much for listening to me in my video journal be inspired um, I'm hoping that this Sorry, it's not so dedicated to my audience, but at this point, I've, like I said, I'm still trying to work this out for me and figure out the best way and plan of attack. So, um, but, you know, just thanks for hearing me out on my journey. That's all I got to say. I appreciate you. Bye-bye.